drop you. No. So this is your host. Again, I think we will press action trigger. I I've been away for a while just to tell you that uh, awesome awesome things have been happening behind the skin where I was away. But that's God has been good. So due to my my experiences and the red uh, a short break. I I I took time to study patterns and you know a repeat a, a repeat a repetitive uh, and recursive patterns that moves the market. I want to tell you that uh, this one will blow your mind. Sit tight. Sit tight. So see what I'm going to show to you. I promise you already, so I have to do this, I have to do this. Yeah, the basic thing is that the knowledge comes from noticing resemblance and recurrences in the events that happen around us. Yeah, if you are the one that has an, an acute uh, observation about things that happen around you, you will be, you exploit a lot of opportunities, you know, in the environment or in your domain, according to Wilfred Trotter. Yeah. And what is a uh, price action? Price action is knowledge about the market forces. That's price action. Simply, it's knowledge about the price action. And the truth is that the uh, patterns in the market remain the same from 2000 years where the market has started till now. Pattern remains the same. Pattern remains the same, especially when you see pattern recurring, recurring. That is what we call the um, 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 that the price is uh, price market is fractal in nature. Whatever pattern that happens in one minute will happen also happen in all the time frame to the monthly time frame. Yeah. So before you can get a monthly time frame, that means within the monthly within the monthly part. Uh, uh, a time frame, there exists pattern that make up the part, the, the monthly part of the higher time frames. So, pattern remains the same. That's the truth of the matter. Pattern remains the same. Yeah, so, you will understand that, that the, 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 the price action is simply is simply a a kind of a, a kind of a DC, a kind of uh, coming, a kind of uh, movement that occurs in the market up and down. Then just simply about the, the, the knowledge of candlestick. This setup I'm growing of is simply a bath. Candlestick pattern. It's kind of purely candlestick. There's no indicator, there is no key for now for this one, especially no indicator for this one. Others, other ones I'm gonna show to you may get to, to do with them. Or uh, 21 EMA at the in uh, exponential moving averages. But for this for this pattern that is blowing the market up and down has to do with candlestick only. Candlestick only has to do with candlestick only. Yeah. Have to do candlestick only. Oh, come in. Has to do with candlestick only. We want to, I believe you, you got a knowledge, a basic knowledge of candlestick. You have a basic knowledge of candlestick. I believe so. You have a basic knowledge of candlestick. So if you don't do about that. Let me let me explain this to you. If you are new in the market, if you are new in this uh, business, let me quickly explain this to you. You know, you know, candlestick has four important information to give to you in the market. Four important information is about opening. It has open 
rent close and high and low. Yeah. If you are new, you got to read, you got to go to internet or go 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 it out about candle stick, study candle stick very well. So you get to get information about this. this thing. So the market opens if you have to be bearish candle stick. That means the market is going to open at the top, then close below. It will open above and close below it. That is that is a bearish candle stick. Now, if you see a full blow, I mean a full bodied uh, body uh, candle stick that opens at the top and close below. That tells you the volume, the volume that was traded in the market. Because the body of the candlestick represents the volume of trading in the market. The, the active market trade, trading activity in, in that, 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 that takes place in that particular time frame you are looking at. It could be one minute, it could be one hour, the rest of them. So the body of the candlestick represents what it represents the actual traders hmm, that took the market and actively to the close of that section yeah so that means for example we have this as a bearish country that means who is in control here the buyers simply buyers of course they are in control they took the market throughout the period they took the market down 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 you see the full body so the long body they represent will represent the volume of active sellers that chase out that drag that, that that drag the market from the top to the bottom. Active sellers. Then in opposite, we have a, this long, long uh, 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 volume of uh, buyers that took the market from the open at the bottom. Market open at the bottom, then they dragged the market, drag the market above, but far top. And at the top, we have a close. That means the close is higher than it open. That is how to recognize bearish and bullish candlestick. This, if you are still new for the purpose of this lecture, go to it or go go, 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 go get a lot of, a lot of books. You can DM me and just a book for you candlestick on candlestick. Now go to go go search out what is candlestick information about candlestick. Get to know the foundation knowledge of candlestick. You understand this better, yeah. So who is in control here? We have a strong bias in control. Strong bias are in control. That's how to identify a momentum or exciting candlestick. So we call this a momentum candlestick. A momentum candlestick. So that web, web, that, 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 that means the body. The body is is is, is the, the, the the volume represented here are higher than the 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 numbers of sellers that are actually traded. Here in the bearish candlestick, the bodies, the volume here are higher than the the, the, the the buyers that traded in the market. So we have that as bearish and, 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 and so we are going to make use of that take note. So now uh, uh, money has his uh Sokyo Koma, the, the the godfather of candlestick. You know, candlestick started from candlestick chart started from Japan. It's in, in about 16th or 17th century. Yeah, through this uh, uh, price trade, uh, trader, the uh, uh, legend, uh, Soki Homa. He talked so much about, exclusively about the uh, three candlestick, three candlestick moving up and down, three candlestick, consecutive candlestick moving up and down. So when you have the first candle in in a trending market, in a trending market that is bullish, a strong trending uh, bullish market, you have at the top of that out of that bullish campaign, these three candlesticks consecutively. In between, there, 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 there will not be opposite candle, no, no sellers, right? The first candle is bullish, the second one is bullish with full body. Some you could get, but at least the body should be much more than the the weak. So the third one we have, we have the the bullish candle, right? So that marks the top of that campaign. It marks the top of the bullish market. Then, well, this is followed by what? Followed by 
a bearish market with full body. With full body. So whenever you get that, it's, it's a sign of, of, of what? A weakness in buy market. It's a sign of a reversal at the top of the market. Take note of this. I repeat. Whenever you get at the top of your long sustaining bullish market, if you can identify these three consecutive running uh, 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 bullish candlesticks, then consequent, sub subsequently you have a bearish candlestick that drops down. Hmm? That drops down below, it could be below, it could be, it could be at least more than the half body of the third candle. This third candle, this third candle, it could be the bond at the half, it could be below it or thereabouts. So we we'll got to, to see that, see several examples. The one, the only thing you need is just one candle see, to cover up the third, the last candle. In the three candlesticks, we have we just have get to identify a bearish candlestick that will cover up, that will engulf it. Either it engulfs it or it penetrates more than the half of that body. It could, it could be it could be this, it could be this. We have this a, a, a bullish candlestick. And you now have you now have a, a this one penetrating even to the half. It could be below it. It could be at the same level with it. As long as we have enough volume that penetrates, enough volume but that penetrates more than the half of the first candle. Hmm? So that's a penetration. That's a good, that's a good market takeover from sellers. It's a good market takeover from sellers. Yeah. See that? So, so this represents a good market takeover from sellers. As long as it has penetrated in the, in the territory of buying zone, more than half. So we have those names of this. It's simply a price rejection. A price rejection. You don't need to give, you don't need to master the, you don't need to, you don't need to memorize the names of candles. Simply a, a what? A price rejection at the top of that uptrend. Market opens here. Hmm? It opens here. Then closes below it. What happens? This is buying, then selling that reverses the buying activity. Right? So that means buying has been hijacked by sellers. Buying has been hijacked by sellers. That is what it means. That is what it means. And oh, in, in, in the opposite, in the opposite, we have this we, the, 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 a long standing bearish market coming to the bottom. Coming to the bottom, the, 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 the decline, I mean, a price decline. It's a, it's a stable price decline. But if you can identify three consecutive uh, bearish candlesticks with full body, not, 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 no, we, 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 you could get a situation where you could have something like this, where you could have something like this, something like this, you could have something like this, you could have something like this. Yeah, it's still intact. Fine, it's still intact. Still intact. Still intact. As long as we don't have an, oppo of an opposing candlestick in between, as long as this could be a doji. This could be a doji. It could be spin it up. It could be a kind of a, a, a low volume kind of stick in between. But as long as we have this drop down with the full body, it's still a bearish movement. It's still significant. So don't be, don't, don't, you don't, you don't have to waste opportunity by just looking at just three full body alone. If you have doji in between, or you have a low volume but in between, it still represents. What it still represents a high volume market of, of selling. As long as the third country after the, the low the, the, the low volume uh, uh, can closes below it, it still represents it. So that is that for so for 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 bearish for for bearish 
that has this at the, at the bottom of the market means we are going to look out for any candlestick, any bullish candlestick and opposing candlestick that will close, that will penetrate upward to the body of the third or, or second candlestick. It could be, it could be, it could penetrate up to, it could, you could have a single candlestick that penetrates up to this level. That's good for you. Even if it is, it is here, it's still good for you. If it's here, it's good for you. As long as we have an opposing candlestick with enough volume that penetrate into the territory of that candlestick. That means, because if you see there from here right now, come down to this place, represent what? Represent a, a volume, a, I mean, a volume of a, of selling market. Now we now have this, trying to penetrate to the, at least to the middle or this. Hmm? So you see part of what we call a, a, a price rejection at the bottom of the market. Right, that's price rejection. This market opens here, then we have a close above it. It's price rejection. So price has been rejected. Selling uh, a lower price has been rejected. So we are we are having an experience, an experience of a, a, a bullish campaign. So whenever you see that, identify you can please take your time to learn how to recognize this pattern. Go through your chart, open up your chart, and see this pattern reoccurring any time frame, no time frame. It could be 30 seconds, it could be one minute, it could be once you have this. I'm telling you, the winning ratio is 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 amazing, it's mind blowing. The winning ratio is mind blowing. Out of 10 trade, out of 10 um, good identifiable pattern you will have here. Rarely you have maybe like out of ten, you can at least you must have like eight, eight that goes in the direction of the opposite opposite uh, uh, candlestick. So if you have this right now, that means you are going to set up for buy. If you have this at the top of the trend, you are going to set up buy. You can use this as a trend reversal, and I'm going to show you the way to trade this in the middle of a trend. That means continuation path as a continuation pattern. Listen very carefully. There are two ways you can trade. You can trade it at the at the end of a trend. You can trade it in the middle of a trend. But you have to guide yourself very well with the information, and you have to protect your, your yourself with your stop loss. Please guide yourself with your stop loss. Now let go to let go to see more explanation of it. We have a bullish market. Market is running upward. Hmm? A break of that is higher high. Mm -hmm. Higher lows, a break of a break of the previous high gives you, you know, a bullish run. Then we have one, two, three consecutive candlestick, right? Then we have them followed by this, followed by this a uh, 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 bearish candlestick that close below this. It could be here. It could close at the same level. And it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. So. What you just is just simply enter your cell here, then put your stop loss at the top and the, the highest high, which is this highest week. And if you don't have a week there, just measure like maybe like five pips or two pips above this level here. Hmm? Put your stop loss there. Put your stop loss in case if the market moves up against you. You are, you are fully protected. So the market is all about probability. Don't don't try to don't try to put yourself into a, a, a heartbreak of say uh, because you have won not won that first trade, you give up. It's about market probability. It's about probability. Yeah, out of ten trade, if you could win, if you could get fifty percent out of ten trade, using your 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 tight as a stop loss, if you get fifty percent, you are see a good trader. You are see a good trader. So if you have almost about like this that like this uh, uh, trade now we give you or at least at least minimum of one ratio three or more than that minimum minimum so if you use if you have 10, 10, 10, 10 stop loss as your risk that means you are going to get times three for reward as your reward as reward it's still okay still good 
Hmm? Time theory of what you risk is what you are getting. Minimum of it is what you are getting in this, in this place. I will show you. It will blow you to blow your mind. In all market, cryptos, uh, stock market, uh, stock indices, NASDAQ, NASDAQ 100, US 500, measure any market. It works so perfectly. And in all time free, one minute, five minutes, you know. So now that means selling here, then you buy at the close, you sell and buy at the close of your posting candlestick that penetrates the, the, the pattern, the setup, right? So that is that. That is that. You're going to see several examples. Several examples. Several examples. The knowledge I'm, sure, I'm I'm giving to you here, you don't need to do a rigorous, it's just simple, just a little information, knowledge about market structure. That is what you need. Either, like if the market is moving, if the market is moving uh, in a in a higher high or higher low, that is that is what you need to get. Where is it, the trade? That's all you need to get about it. That's all you need to get. The formation of when the market is in a bearish structure or, 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 or downtrend, which is you have a lower high, lower low, lower high, lower low, lower low, lower high, lower low. As long as the previous low is being broken below, you have a bearish market structure in place. If you are still new, please. You, you you can you can you have a lot of resources in the archive archive to study market structure very well. I'm not saying you should, it's not a, this pattern does not need a but it's for those who are already trader a trader already who are traders. So the, because of information of candlestick and again the structure market structure, you don't need rigorous market analysis or rules or it's just get to know about when the market is down and when the market is up. And when the market is ranging, that's all you need to. That's all you need to. That's all you need to get in the market. That's all you need to get in the market. Yeah. All you need to get in the market. Like for example, if the market is in bearish in a, in a bullish market, that is higher high and a, and higher low, higher low. So that means the market is in higher high and higher low. Market is in higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher low. Then that's move is moving in an upward, an upward manner, right? So you get together. So you have this. You have to look at this information. So I've shown you, I've shown you this, I've shown you the, the setup pattern. You just have to, you just have to do what I've shown you the short the the I'll show you the the Yeah, so I'll show you. you. Just have to get to practice and master this skill. The beginning of knowledge is discovery of something you don't understand. The beginning of knowledge. Don't don't relax back. Don't just just continue to 
and you continue to do your own listing. Open up your chart, exploit this pattern in the market, how this market, market this pattern moves now and then in the market. Yeah. So let's go to see some examples. Some examples. You can imagine if we are some of the examples, past, past, past examples you have in the market. This is a, this is Euro, this is Euro USD, weekly charts, Euro USD. The market has come down so much, so much, so has been in a long standing trend. Uh, 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 market has been a long standing, very strained. We have the, we have the, we have the, we have the higher, the, sorry, the lower high hmm, and the lower low. Hmm, and, and this one breaks the previous low downward. Then the market comes to the final bottom. Now we have this one, two, then the third candlestick. As long as we have a body, we have a body there. Yeah. So perfect. No, in between, there is no green candlestick that represents by the in between the one, two, three candlesticks. There is no single, there is no single uh, 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 volume, no, 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 no volume, no active bias in between. So the week will represent the, the those week the, those week represent non-active bias that they were uh, they were being driven out by by sellers. So we are only looking for the body of the country. The body of the country is what we are looking for. The body of country. Remember, I told you the body represents the volume. Yeah. The week represents price rejection. The body represents the volume of activity that was traded in the market. So now we have this. You can see the, the big long candlestick here moving upward, moving upward to close. Moving upward above the the third candlestick, can you see it? Moving upward uh, 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 above the, the this candlestick and closes almost to the final top of that. Uh, I mean, the beginning of that uh, 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 three set of candlestick. Can you see that? But well, this is a weekly chart, right? This is a weekly chart. What you need to do is just to do what. Once the market starts getting to this place, this is the logic of it. Because you are going to, if you enter here on the weekly chart, you're going to use a a, a long, uh, a, a very a very huge stop loss to be required, right? You can do it in in two ways. You can switch over to from here. You switch over when you start seeing the market moving above the the third candlestick. What you need to do is just to switch to the you switch to the to a lower time frame than daily four hours, then you can still see more pattern of this one two three in within this weekly time frame. You can do that first. Then secondly, if you allow the market to close here into the above the range of the theory setup, right? If you allow the market to close into the into the, the body, that means you've gotten your what you've gotten your Good setup. Can you see it? So that means this is a very, very big, huge price rejection. You can imagine market opens here, hmm? opens here, then it closes here. Can you see it? So this, from here to this place, represent what? Represent, represent, it represents a week, entire week of candlestick. And what what does uh, 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 signifies? It signifies price rejection. The numbers of sellers that were driven out of the market by by what by sellers. This is what you get. This is what you get in that place. If you collapse the, the you know the number of collapsing the candles. If you collapse the, this, this is what you get. This is what you get. Hmm? Pimba. This is what you get.
So once this place closes, once this, once this candle kind of closes above here, hmm, so that you can imagine from there upward, from here upward, up to the top of this place, with on weekly charts, you get that as profit. And meanwhile, probably your, your, your stop loss is still below, but check very well the number of the stop loss you are going to be using. Then this is a uh, AUD USD four hours chart. Market moves up was in this in a in a in a, in a well defined uh, what in a well defined well defined uh, bullish market breaks above the previous high, previous day high or previous a uh, uh, weekly weekly high. Hmm? Then we have consecutive one. Two, three. Hmm? We can do this one, two, three. As long as there is no it's in between, no bearish candles in between until we get to this place that this one closes below, below here. And you see, it closes below this. It closes below this. And you see this place, this one, this one here. So that's an engulfed, engulfed uh, 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 sellers. So what happened? Your stop loss is here. Then you enter your cell immediately. You enter your cell here. You can imagine from this place down. So this is a news. Okay? So you don't you don't need to be intimidated about that. From here to this place is enough for you as a scalper. If you are if you are scalping, then if you got this, if you got this, and you got this again, can you see it? It will blow your mind, I'm telling you. It will blow your mind. See this. See, one, two, three. Then you have a cover up here. Buyers have been, well, have been attacked. Right? So you put your normal stop loss at the top of that week. Then you sell here. You sell. So this is your risk level. It becomes your risk level for this market. Then from here to down, 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 what to this place becomes your worth, your, your, your profit, yeah, your profit. So, then in between the market, for this one, this is a top reverser. 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 Then. We have this as worth, we have this, all this as, as a continuation pattern of it. Hmm? You see this? This, one, two, three. This is a continuation pattern of it. We'll talk about that, how to trade the, 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 in the middle of a train so that you don't put yourself on a hot, on a hot, uh, uh, so, uh, yeah. So that's that for, now we could see more, 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 more ex ex examples. See more examples. See more examples. I'm going to show it to you. Get to see more examples here. This is one hour chart, one hour chart of the uh, what of crude oil. One hour chart of crude oil, right? One hour chart. Can you see it? You see it? Price moves, price moves, moves from.
can imagine the movement. So breaks below the previous low. Then we have the first one. First one, second one. Let me put this on the red color. First one, second one, then the third. Hmm? Then we have this as a cover up. Can you see that? You can imagine the level of this in here, stop loss here, the level of your risk here. Can you see that? And why this is, you, you buy at the close of this, or you can come here to buy, or you went, you go to straight to a lower time frame, like one minute or five minutes to enter your, to see more pattern. Because this pattern has a hidden, a hidden uh, 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 lower time frame pattern in between that will allow you to take a very, very, a very, very small, very low risk. But this is still okay, good, in one hour, in one hour. Take the risk, and you can imagine on crude oil, crude oil, see, then you get to the top, or the, the top here, Mm -hmm. This is previous day high. Then we have one, two, three. Full, full consecutive, uh, full bodied cons consecutive uh, bullish uh, 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 candlestick. Then you have this as a cover up by sell from seller. Mm -hmm. Your stop loss is here. Then you can imagine to this place what you take out of the market. Showing you just. Just take your time to 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 to, to, to go through this uh, uh, video and you know, then you have this previous day taken out by one two three. Hmm? Then you have this as a cover up by bullish market uh, 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 structure. Then you have the candlestick that close above can enter here. Fair fast uh, this thing. Your stop loss here, hmm? fair fast. This or you wait for this place to come up to the to the entire range of that, uh, at least more than half of the range of the three candlestick. Then you see a you see a kind of BMS, your BMS, then a, 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 a pullback to it will give you a nice entry. Connectly, that uh, you already have a setup, a complete setup in place. Once the setup is in place, that's all you need. The conditions are met. A condition three candlestick down and up, then a cover up from the opposing candlestick. That is the setup. Very simple, very very simple. That is it. But you always need to number one. This thing I'm going to tell you is that uh, you really want the, the guidelines that will guide you as in as in uh, checklist that I call I will call checklist. You trade this pattern in the context of the main trend. You go to look into that. But I just want to show you series. Of examples, you know, that's the one that's happening right now, right now, and the past series of examples. Then see this, see this, hmm? it will blow your mind. I'm telling you, this will blow your mind. Can you see that? Oh, see, it's not. I see that this is one, hmm? one, two, then three. I see that bullish candlestick at the top of it. Then we have this close down below it. So this one, this play will be your place. Take notes where you got to put your stop loss. In this case, I would prefer to put it here, not here. Hmm? Because of what I already have, price may come back a little bit. So you just have to be very smart. I'm telling you, you just have to be, be the, the, the market will move in that direction. But sometimes, in a, on a rare occasion, you may still have a, a kind of this start to want to take out this liquidity here, then start coming down here. You will see it in several in several examples. Right? Now what you have here, you can you can see it here. What you have here, this place came down to trigger out to trigger out the, the law of this place. Love this place, love this place. But don't be, you can still re enter your trade. Don't give up. As long as the pattern is maintained and you have your stop loss on this in, in order, I told you it's a bad probability. You are intact. 
your listening sister. You can imagine what you have here. Hmm? Then see. See what you cover up as a profit. Then if you can see this place here. One, two, three. One, two, three. Then you have a cover up. Hmm? You can imagine what you have. One, two, three. One, two, three. A cover up. Hmm? This is two candles, not three. I'm looking for three. Three. So two candles is still what I'm looking for a good one, good setup. Has been taught by 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 Suki Homa. Yeah. So three, three candles running down on up consecutively. Running down on top. Then we have this one, two, three. No dark candle between here and here. And you have a cover up here. Can you see that? Cover up. See the market moves down. The market moves down. He moved down in in a huge cell. The market moved down in a huge cell. In a huge cell. So it's an opportunity for you. It's an opportunity for you to grab that and sell it down. Right? So then we have this on the 16th of May. This is a uh, This is uh this is this is this is fast on the May. You can see this. See it previous day one, two, three. Can you see this? On crude oil. This is one hour. On crude oil. Can you see that? One, two, three. Above. Then Below it, hmm? price move down. One, two, three. Hmm? Above, below it. Then you see this. See this. See this. One, two, three. Then you have this above. You can see that price comes down to take out this. Don't be, don't be scared. As long as you can see re-enter, as long as the pattern here is 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 is, is seen that price breaks above it again. You have this three, then went up like that. That is that is. So, so wonderful. Yeah, it's taking time. My connection is. My internet is slow. So, that is giving, really giving me problem okay. here. I think it's raining. That's true. The rain is trying to disrupt. But this is this is um this is crude oil. I love crude oil. Highly volatile. 
or if you can meet me. This pattern is, is highly predictive on crude oil. This crude oil one hour, can imagine? You can imagine what you have here. See, price moves down. Hmm? One, one, two, three. Can you see it? And we have a cover up here. It's never, price never came down to touch this and start moving upward. Can you see that? Moving upward. That here we have at the top of it here. Hmm? One. See it? This, this, and this. No consecutive, three consecutive uh, bullish can you see? Then we have a cover up. Mm -hmm. Price never. So we have a kind of a this here, see, it's raging, raging, raging. You just be be be, be focused, be be alert. Don't need to you, know, you 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 as long as you have a cover up below this candlestick, the first candlestick, the, the, the third candlestick. It's what you need. A price moves down. And mind you, moves down up to that place. You see in the five minutes. You see the five minutes. You see the five minutes. We we'll show you the five minutes now. I imagine uh, what we have here. See it here. See the five minutes. It's still moving. This is good. Five minutes. On five minutes. Chat. Good. See it. See it here. Price move from here. Can you see it? Breaks above this. That's the bullish structure, right? Mm -hmm. Close above. One, two, three. Then we have a structure. Be taken out. Be reversed. See it. You see it. Don't mind about this one that the intruder, this is an intruder. As long as we have a close of a bearish candlestick, this is the pattern in focus. Are you going to or the pattern in focus? Not this one, not this one. In focus. This is what we are looking at. We have a close below it. Hmm? Then what happens? Down, 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 down. That is why, that's where you need to, you need to concentrate your this. And then you have, have this. Hmm? Now, one, two, three. Break. Can you see that? You can imagine your, your, your stop loss from here to this place. That's almost about uh, nine pips. Then it moves down to almost about 222 pips. Right now, at press, as I'm telling you, right, I'm showing you, and this is this is a current trade, a current uh, pattern uh, 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 that gives us 226 pips, using nine pips. Please, if you can still go to, you might, if you still go to to one minute, please take it to one minute. If you still take it to one minute, one minute. Now imagine what you have there. One minute. You can see, take, take it to one minute. This is one minute or 30 seconds or there about. You can imagine what you have so that you, you use, there is no this thing on, on one minute. For five minutes, we have it set up on five minutes. Good. See it. Hmm? So probably this is your, if you don't have this thing done, you enter your five minutes. Hmm? So the purpose of going to, to, to lower time frame to is just to reduce your this but my pips is still okay for standard uh, uh loss side that's 90 dollars and you are getting two thousand something above. See this? See it here. This previous day slow. Hmm? Market moves down. No, oh, sorry, this previous day low. Previous day low and market moves down with three consecutive candlestick close below it. That's liquidity graph, right? Then we have this machine up to it. Which you can see machine up to it. I imagine rice will never come down 
play very rare. Price will never come to the zero lot. And you are riding a wave. This is one, two, three. You can see one, two, three. Continuation. Continuation. Hmm? One, two, three. There's a good dodgy in between. Then we have this complete circle. I, you know, I told you, I have dodgy in between. You see the same uh, 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 trend. You see this? So you continuation. You can't just draw your, you just continue to draw your stop losses to close, you know, at this below here, below here, below a new a new formation. Then you are, you are, you are, you are trading the profit upward. You are trading the profit upward. Hmm? See this? Hmm? One, two, three. Hmm? Then what happens? You can imagine a close here, then because oh, that's almost about five pips to get almost uh, 44 pips. Hmm? So that's the that's the, that's the, that's the beauty of this of this of this uh, pattern. You see it? A close above this previous high at a key resistance level. We have one, two, three. Then have this. Then if you if you are very aggressive, six pips to get to gain uh, one hundred four pips. If you are very aggressive, you are the aggressive type, and you are smart enough. Wow, great! See? One, two, three. Hmm? But here you are trading against the market here because this has not been confirmed, right? Because the market is still down, down. So all you'll be doing is to sell at a pullback. You sell at a pullback. Sell at a pullback when the market is down. Sell at a pullback. See this one? See this? See it? It covers the entirety of this one, two, three. And what do you have here? Move down. You see this? It cover up. So this range, what do you have here? You see this, you cover up. <laughs> so, so, so which, so which, I'm telling you, so which. One, two, three, you cover up. See, for binary traders, binary traders, this is, this is, congr I'm, I'm telling you, this is congratulations to you. See, one, two, three. Hmm? For binary trader, this is five minutes on gold. And be scalping it up and down, up and down. I think you can get like 10 trades in a day. In a day, like this Tuesday, today's Tuesday. And get 10 trades on the 20th of June. See, one, two, three. I don't close above the last one, then it moves upward. Euro USD. Euro USD. Let's see Euro USD. See it, see it, Euro USD. It moves now. One, two, three. Forget about this place and market move about as long as we have this pattern in that. We don't have we have we don't have three candles here. This is the this is this this thing I'm telling I'm I'm, I'm telling you about. You don't trade you don't trade outside the context of the trend. Like for example, here now, hmm, this is what we call a continuation pattern, a continuation mm -hmm. pattern. It breaks the previous low. Hmm? Then a, a pullback to it with one, two, three. Then a cover up. It comes down. Hmm? You don't trade outside the context of the markets, of market trend. Yeah, prevailing market trend. See this? Moves down. Hmm? Three candles. Then a close. Finish, move down. That is the that is the logic for you. Please repeat it. If you don't understand, just let me know. If you don't see or see it, just and comment on my video. I'm going to post this one. And comment on the GM meme or you GM for that is for the regular the, the, the detail, full detail I'm preparing for for the executive uh, members. To be fair enough, yeah, yeah, of course, they have paid a lot of which amount of money. 
for my programs. See, this is one hour. Wow, code is still selling. Up to now, this is one minute on good. Code is still selling. Selling. See, this is a pullback. See it? Pullback. Hmm? This will be your, your what you call a, what they call a, uh, uh, other blocks, right? So you can use it, you can use it uh, in conjunction with your normal pattern. You can use it as a stand alone, a low stuff. You can use it in conjunction with your DC. Right? See it? I mean, that color is not... Uh, See that hmm? in one minute you can imagine what you what you are taking out here yeah. hmm? yeah this is this is 78 and this Uh, seven pips. So, like for example, here now, you don't buy here. You don't buy. No, it's strong to buy. You you only look out to sell. You don't buy here. You look look out for what for a a theory like here. You sell. Hmm? This one two three a pullback. After the break of this, uh, look, after the this look, you pull back with a three consecutive candlestick, and then you have a close below it. That gives you yourself. You don't buy against uh, a bearish market. It's risky. It's risky. Please note that. Note that. See this. Hmm? See this. Buy because this is what this is a a bearish formation. Sorry, a bullish formation. Hmm? This one minute, if you, if you can go, if, if you can be very smart enough to scalp up and down. One minute. See it? One, two, three. See it? Moves. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. A close above it, then upward. Mm -hmm. Most about uh, four, four pips or thereabouts. Then we have almost about, uh, you know, 300 or thereabouts. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. You close below it, you sell. Mm -hmm. You say, how do you, how do you know the exchange in market, in, in market structure? Of course, that's another knowledge for you. That's another knowledge. That's another knowledge for you. And join the, the private this. That's another knowledge. So that you don't always, yes, you hit or you're the same always. So that is the short video. We will see. We I can see we bring more a lot of more um, more examples of trade or trade, you know. Uh, looking for a set of a new set of that can just just as a oh, this is huge. This is huge. This is huge. On a uh, on today, it has been massive. It has been massive, massive, be massive. On five minutes, see it, crude oil. See it, <laughs> massive. See it. Previous day high. Hmm? Previous day high was taken out. Hmm? Those are the significant points. I'm sure. I'm telling you, if you are smart enough. You'll be grabbing them with those points. Previous day high and previous day low is your focus. Then key support and resistance. That is high and low. Previous high and low. Mm? Like this place now. I might this is a mm? double bottom or double double bottom or 
imagine or a liquidity when liquidity is grabbed with this three pattern i'm just showing you what i needed to give to my executive when liquidity is being grabbed by this three pattern you see liquidity grab yeah Take, taking out this liquidity below this low then you can you can imagine the the move upward against it hmm? then you have your your normal this this is crude oil very highly uh, predictive of crude oil highly predictive of crude oil you use just uh how many points that's 19 to get almost about there uh, almost about 130 points 130 points can you see this place here you see this here you can see this one two three hmm? this place represent what as long as you have in between uh -huh. so and you have this one that goes up to complete the, 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 the bullish stop and you have a close below it. You can imagine this give you a very low, a very, a very low risk here. Then up to this place, cutting by some 213 pips or thereabouts. Mm -hmm. While you are using just just eight pips. In standard loss size 80 pips, then you have almost a buffet. You can take the hearts. That's 2,120 or 120. So that is that. So, so, so huge. So, wow. See this. See this. Market moves to close below this. Can you see this? Can you see this? Hmm? Three. Then they, they move above it. Hmm? See this? Hmm? Three. Then it close above it moving upward close above it this is your stop loss 18 pips hmm? on crude oil crude oil you can use it to scalp crude oil up and down but crude oil is you have to get a a a, a like a minimum capital of like maybe like 100 or thereabouts to really require because of the dc yeah. uh, the volume so you can't take oil with uh, 10 pips or, or maybe 10 dollars or five or 50 dollars or you can do that with gold and other market see this hmm? one two three price moves see it no indicator no indicator just understand the market trend hmm? and the taking out of the liquidity you see this see this moves it's good oil Hmm? One, two, three. Hmm? Market never comes down below this place and start moving upward. Hmm? B. Market never moves down below this place. You see it? So fantastic. So fantastic. God bless you. Please take note. I, I really want I really want you to do your to do your DC. I really want you to do your your back testing. Don't jump, don't jump. So you can see more, more this thing. Your focus is on when you when 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 you trade in the context of the main trend, hmm, that's major support and resistance at the top and the bottom. Then if the setup happens, you know, by if the setup happens at a pullback, at a pullback of that trend, that's continuation. Then, if it happens at a, a trail and breakout, fine. Then, if it happens at a liquidity zone, liquidity, what are the liquidity zone? Liquidity are the previous high and lows, liquidity session. Like, you can have a, a, a intraday session like a London and a, Lord, Lord and New York. So, you can have those ones. You can have those ones. So, this is a uh, Imagine this place. See, this is a, this is what this is a, this daily chart. Hmm? One, two, three. It's taking out of liquidity here. I tell you, you, you must trade in the context of the trade. A trade and you don't buy here. It's very risky to buy, though it goes upward. <laughs> but you know, you are looking for, you'll be looking for where to sell, not to buy, so that you can be at a, at a safe, safe, safe like this place here. This place, hmm? 
from here down market has been ranging, 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 ranging there below. This one comes lower than this. Hmm? Then you have this a grab of liquidity. Hmm? Then one, two, three. What happened? <laughs> so so much, so much. See this. See this. See this. One, two, three. Hmm? And you move up for this daily chart on crude oil. And imagine what happens there at last. You sell here. You sell here. And you target here. Hmm? Can you imagine you're this in there? You're this in there almost about 10, 28 or there about or 289 is point. Yeah, so your target is here. Yeah. My target is this place here. Yeah. Most about 387. So you can go to a lower time frame to lower your DC. So once you get this set up, in right place, go to the lower time frame. My entire your DC at a preferred uh, low risk. Uh, so let's play forward to see this market move. I imagine market moves in your favor. It never blow out of this above you. Maybe here, from here to this place, that's giving you. That's giving you your, your good profit. See, almost about 430 points. Mm -hmm. See, it hits the DC. Hits the DC. Right? One, two, three. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Can you see that? Moving upward because it's at a key support level. It happens at key support level, and this happens at, at its resistance level. Can you see that? Support level, resistance level. Can you see this one? One, two, three. Mm -hmm. So it happens if, if, especially another point is if it happens at a fair value gap, that is uh, after other blocks, you see it as fair value gap. Mm -hmm. Like this place, for example, this one now happens here. It happens here. This is at uh, uh, in the other blocks this week. Single, you remember what this is. So you can, you can, one well, you can combine this with your strategy or use it in, as a standalone, as a standalone stuff. See this, you see that. At a support, key support level. Mm -hmm. Support. From here to this place, it's enough for you. It's enough for you. A key resistance. Key resistance. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Please, you have a move. See, and we we'll give you enough, enough tips. There is nothing you lose that you will not give me in this pattern. That's why I love it. Because that is sweet. After it. So that's how you trade. You can combine it with your knowledge of ICT or, or smart money concept. 
マネメント。マイネメント。こういうのを、ちょっと例の、ユースで、マイネメント。マイネメント。コンケー、ドツのセット、ユノ、コバロ。で、コンケー、トゥリス、エクセルノ。So, no point for you. That's almost about 420 points. 420 points.、Hmm? So, all you just need to do is just to, just to get your d i s c i p l i n you know,、uh, go to your lower time. And, you know, around. You are going to read on our end. I mind you, the water can have the seeds here. See the, if you go to the water, you will have enough food like this. Comfortable to have this is your top of this cover up here. You see, I almost give back. This is about 48 points. 48 points here.、Yeah. Mm. Then, From here upward, imagine what you have to cover up. It was 590 something. That's good enough. That's good enough. So you just switch over, to, you just need to switch over to this thing. And then, and then create. Now, for example, this is one hour, right? And imagine that one hour now. If you want to do it, have your. Switch over to like five minutes. If you get to wow, good ones, good ones, good ones. See it here one, two, three, cover up it, then that, 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 that. And subsequently, you see how good set up here one, two, three, they cover up here, and then move down. One, two, three, cover up. Down, 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 down. You are selling.、Hmm? Take out this liquidity.、Yeah. Take out that, just that liquidity.、Hmm? Liquidity was taken out here. Then you move. The cover up.、Hmm? Yeah, liquidity was taken out. Today, this happened today. You can imagine today what we have today. Five, on five minutes, chat. Five minutes on food oil. The food is taken out by this setup.、Hmm? You taking out, see it? Move down. The food is taken out. Oh my God. I'm just revealing another secret to you. The points you need to, to guide yourself. I don't think I will. I, I, I will appreciate my to tell you this because I will. I will, I will tell you that. You s a n d for my. Yeah. The pretty graph, you see this, the pretty graph, the pretty concept, you know. Then, this is previous set, see, very structure. If you break this, very structure, then you pull back to it, you have this, as the pretty, yeah, you just make taking out or the pretty taking out, then you break below, then, wow, that is it. This is a structure, a break of structure, a pullback to it. With this, a break of structure, a pullback to it.、Hmm? You can see that. So for today, l o n e on food oil, you can imagine, imagine, imagine a break of it. Your s u p p l i a break of it. Imagine in between, the pullback. Just focus on it. If you were to take on a continuation, this year, focus on the what? On the pullback. See it. See this.、Hmm? Oh my God. Oh my God. On today alone, you can see how many, on five minute、uh, time frame of crude oil, you can see how many trades, how many things you, you scrap the up and down, up and down. A grab of this. See it. The pretty grab. Previous high was taken out, then see it close below. Previous high was taken out, 
up and down, up and down, up and down. Hmm? See, this place is not in the author. You can just take it as you know. Oh my God, oh my God. Previous high taken out or inducement taken out. Hmm? So if you have knowledge of inducement, liquidity inducement, you can use this as a support, this thing, right? Liquidity graph. Hmm? See it. See this? It happens at where? At where? At fair value gap. See it? It's fair value gap now. It's fair value gap. Hmm? Fair value gap. And what happened there? <laughs> See this one? Hmm? Sadly, you see a field, a field that is in here. Hardly you get a field. A field. See, previous, this is breaking over to it with this. So that's when you get this, uh, you get this, you know, a, a flip zone, uh, a support, then broken below, then you have this. Yeah. You have this. So here, here you are using this as worth. That's a, a, a demand broken below. Then this. so you look out for what you look out for candlestick that will that will a candlestick here a a a a a, a, a consecutive uh, bullish candlestick hmm? like it happens here. See it here. See it here. Break up breaking. See consecutive one. Hmm? Break below it. See it here. Hmm? So we, have, we don't have consecutive one here. Hmm? But if you have any situation where you have a consecutive where this is like that, that, like here, just take your trade. Just take your trade. Just take your trade. Yeah. See this one. See this place. See this. You break this place. You see one, two, three. You move higher. See this place. It breaks it. Fair value gap. At flip zone, you know, that's how to trade it. So when you have a combination of other points, you know, helping you, that will help you. This God bless you. I really touch much on this. I really touch much. Touch much on this. They touch much on this. Please try to invest in yourself. Invest in yourself. According to uh, Benjamin Franklin, you know, investment in yourself, in, 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 in right knowledge, pays the best interest. Invest in yourself, in your capacity to build your knowledge. Please. Very, very important. Invest in your, in the knowledge of the market. Yeah. Very important. And lastly, all we are doing is to keep trading as simple as ABC. Keep it simple. Keep it simple. God bless you. So you can DM me, you can, you can DM my, my, my store man. DM me at, uh, you know, on my Telegram. If you are having issue, you know, you want me to, I can do good work. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's my my stuff. Then my this thing is for it's yeah. So let's talk. Let's talk. Bless you. God bless you, God bless you, God bless you, God bless you.